tell them anything. But others, they need to understand this. You don't have to become what your parents want you to become. I personally don't care a damn what you become. But whatever the hell you become, you better be good at it. That's all that matters <laughs> And being good at something will not come because you desire. There is a striving, there is an involvement, there is a certain devotion to what you're doing. People misunderstand… I'm… I'm specifically using the word devotion because people think devotion means going to the temple, church or mosque or something like this. No, just look at life and see. Whatever the arena of life, sport, art, music, business, whatever, has anybody gone to any significant levels without devotion? No. So devotion means unconditional involvement, not comfort and discomfort. When it's comfortable, I will do it. When it's not comfortable, I'll not do it. Well, we are sitting with a sports person, if you want to use that example, it is not comfortable to be a sports person. Every damn muscle hurts <laughs> Yes, <laughs> everything hurts. It is all nice for you to see in the television, they're just falling up and you know, flipping up and falling down. Do once like that, you won't get up for a month <laughs> Yes, most people don't know. And um, India being a cricketing nation, largely most people have only seen cricket matches, very few people have unfortunately have seen football, hockey and other matches, which should come back. I think it is to some extent making a thing. It was very wonderful you made that appeal. So we all responded for you <laughs> See, among the many games, for example, because India, a lot of people are playing cricket, uh, many of them on the street side playing with a tennis ball, they won't understand what it is. When you play with a cricket ball, it's one of the most dangerous games you can play. It's a hard ball and it is coming at like over 120, 130 kilometers per hour at you. And the biggest problem is it pitches and changes direction as it wants. It has a mind of its own. Most of the time, even the bowler does not know where it will go <laughs> Not just the batsman. Yes, the… the pitch and the wind and so many things decide how it goes. So, people are watching on the television and advising how Tendulkar doesn't know <laughs> you know <laughs> uh, It's not that. When you're there out there, it's a dangerous thing. Sport is a dangerous thing in many ways. People… you… it could break your body, just like that. And above all, even if you don't break, every day it's painful. It's painful and painful and painful. No matter what the hell is happening in your life, morning five o'clock you get up and run and do this and do that and all kinds of things. Most people cannot keep such discipline in their life. So, the important thing is, there is a certain devotion to what you're doing. Otherwise, you will not go through that pain. First bit of pain, you will turn back and sleep. And uh, you know, like we trek in the mountains, every year I think, just now I came back for three weeks of uh, being in Himalayas, both in Nepal and Tibet. We are going up to seventeen five to eighteen thousand feet. Every year I think enough I've done. From the age of nineteen, almost every year I've trekked in the mountains. And I think it's enough, these sore muscles and bad bathrooms and everything, I say enough of it. But within two months, mountains are again <laughs> calling you. And uh, at this stage in my life, it could be very painful. Painful means because we are pushing at a certain speed, it can be painful, but there is an acceleration, there is a certain joy, there is a certain indescribable experience of life which others will never know. So, it is not necessarily you have to climb a mountain or f play football. You will know this, if you know that level of involvement in something, where it brings you to a sense of abandon, where it's almost like you are hanging between life and death at certain moments, those moments are an experience beyond anything. There are no uh, vocab… there is no vocabulary for that. When you touch that place, you know 
you can cross anything. <laughs> I'm sure any number of times in the games, it happens <laughs>